Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another Iron Man progress video. This is episode number 49. I'm gonna be continuing with Slayer in this episode. Um, managed to find a Dragon Impling randomly um, just as I was about to record this introduction, so uh, see so if we can get anything good from that. Magic Seed, that's actually pretty good. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this episode and uh, let's see what we can get done. Alright, just managed to complete this hard clue in time. Uh, system update is coming. What can we get? Armadillo page, that's worth a fair bit. Already completed the book though, so nothing too useful there. Wow, I've got a lot, I've got a lot of these pages. Right, so just spent a bit of time uh, mining these salts and uh, basalt, which um, I haven't done before, and it did take a lot longer than I was expecting. Basically, this is going to allow me to unlock all of the um, the fire pits that you get after the quest, and also the unlimited teleports in the Nexus portal once that's released, because you do need a thousand. Um, times the single teleport cost for that and uh, also a hundred of the teleports to the herb patch which I haven't actually been using I need to get back into the flow of um, of doing herb runs I'm thinking like even if I can just do one or two a day and uh, tree runs and seaweed and um, bird houses as well it's something I need to keep up with um, and yeah that'll, that'll all help with that so I'm um, looking forward to the Nexus portal update when that comes and uh, got all that prepared for that. Haven't done a um, gorillas task in a while, but that's 208 black demons. So I still need the fourth zenite, and I'm hoping to get a heavy frame as well, so that I can make the heavy ballista. Um, I think if I get the fourth zenite before the heavy frame, I'm not sure if I'll camp for it in the future, but um, hopefully we can get something good on this task. All right, got ourselves a hard clue. What can we get? Yeah, not too bad. 250k, I will take that. And another hard clue. I've got a feeling I needed that for something. I can't remember if it's an extra helm or shield. That could be really useful. I might be able to finish up uh, one of my hidey holes. Yep, I was spot on. So I can now fill both the agility pyramid and the Karazi jungle stash units, which is pretty good. And it means um, that's all of the hard stash units filled out. I've got easy, medium, hard, um, most of the elite ones, um, and then masters. I haven't done any yet, but um, that'll be very handy. Another pair of ballista limbs. I think that might be my fourth or maybe even my fifth now. Um, yeah, don't really need them. Don't really want them. They're just there, just gonna sit in the bank now. Pretty useless. Yes, I got it, heavy frame. So that means the only drop I need to complete um, gorillas, barring the light frame, because I don't really need that, I suppose, once you've got the uh, heavy frame, is gonna be the last Zen I shard that I need. So that's really good. Hopefully we'll get that this task. Quite surprised this thing's so cheap as well. I mean, it's one of the rarer drops you can get here. It's one in 1.5K, I think, that's the drop rate. Um, so either there's like another component that has, um, you know, a more expensive price or it's just not used that much. I mean, for me, I don't actually think the heavy blister has too many uses, but it's kind of nice to have, uh, cause it's a pretty rare drop and getting it before the last end night's nice cause it means you don't have to camp, but yeah, if that's only worth 45 K that's pretty surprising. All right. So unless I'm mistaken, I just need one of my limbs, uh, a spring, the monkey tail, and putting that all together. Oh. There we go, heavy blister. That's pretty badass. I just got the uh, fishing pet, um, doing some karamb ones. Um, 86 fishing. I saw it pop up and I just figured someone else had, uh, had come join me, but there we go. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to getting a pet actually that I don't have on my main account because I think all of the ones that I've got on this account I've already got. So it'd be nice to get something a little bit different, but hey, that's pretty cool. And there we go, a fishing level as well. That is 87. All right, got an easy, medium and hard clue. Can we get anything nice? Nope. 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 Well, that is another pair of ballista limbs. Um, yeah, don't have any use for those. Um, I only had the one uh, monkey tail, so even if I got another um, frame, I wouldn't be able to make 
uh, another blister unfortunately but yeah there we go all right well this will be the last kill of the task so unless we get a Zene on uh, this kill I'm gonna have to come back for at least one more task um, over 1300 kills now so fingers crossed the next Zenite doesn't take too long to get all right got another hard clue can this one be better than the last marginally I guess up to 151 now though which is pretty cool so I haven't had a Kraken task in absolutely ages and I didn't realize that I had this many kills but this is gonna be number 1000 um, there's still a decent um, you know number of drops that you can get here that I feel make it worth doing mostly the Sandfew serums to be honest because um, I do like to use those at Dagonoth Kings um, so that would be a good thing to stock up on and um, just the other regular drops are pretty decent as well. Well that didn't take long, back to uh, Demonic Gorillas and see if we can pick up the fourth Zenite Shard. That's a pretty juicy task, um, nearly as big as a task you're going to get. Um, yeah, I feel like there's a decent chance I'll get it in this uh, in this task, so let's see. Hard clue from Skatizo. Uh, nothing too special there. I've got one more totem, so as I'm on task, I figured I might as well go and do uh, the two that I had, so see if we can get uh, anything good from the next kill. All right, what have we got? Oh, I already have those. Well, it's worth nearly a mil, so good for the bank value, but um, yeah. That's just going to be a placeholder in my bank, I guess. There we go. That is Zenite Shard number four. I never have to come back here again. I'm going to go and see exactly how many kills that took. Um, I don't have the crafting level to turn that into the, um, what is it, Amulet of Torture. Um, I nearly got the level I need for the magic one banked. Let's have a look. 1341, very nice. Just found a random lucky impling. This is actually the first one I've ever seen, so I don't know whether to open it or save it um, because I feel like in the future they might buff um, the drops that these have because they're really shit at the moment. You can roll some terrible loot off the clue scroll tables. Um, but I'm just going to give it a go. Let's see what we can get. Yeah, well, I mean... How much is that worth? 67k to be fair that's that's not bad I'll take that. That's a pretty decent number of Dagonos so I will head back to DK's uh, still looking for a second dragon axe and the archer's ring um, but the bones are really good for prayer so this is always going to be a good task for me to do I think. God another hard clue what can we get this time? Ah, nearly 100k not too bad. There we go, that is the uh, second dragon axe, so, well, I mean, basically that is just useful for me because it's an emote clue item and I don't really want to use the infernal axe for regular woodcutting, so that's pretty nice. Remaining drops I need to get are the warrior ring from Rex, the seer cull from uh, Supreme, and the archer's ring. I think I've pretty much got everything else, so um, slowly get in there. All right, last kill of the task. I did end up getting a second dragon axe, but I didn't bother recording. Um, I figured in the future I'd probably just call, uh, record the ring drops because they're the ones that are worth a fair bit of money but if you'd like to see the, um, the secondary drops like the dragon axes um, and the mud battle stuff and all stuff like that do let me know and I can throw them in but I figured they'd just be a bit boring to be honest. Alright got a medium clue and a hard clue can we get anything good? Nothing from the medium and nothing from the hard. Got two more clues, a hard and an elite. What can we get? Hard one first. Oh dear. And nothing too special from the elite either, unfortunately. All right, so the last thing I want to do in this episode is finish up making the tormented bracelet. I need to get two crafting levels and then I can get a plus five boost. I've got all the molten glass, so that shouldn't take too long. And then I'll probably end up selling some chaos runes for the tockle to get the onyx. Um, may end up going to Barrows for a bit to stock those up because I don't think I've quite got enough. But um, yeah, I think that would be a good way to round off the episode. There we go, that's 89, so just one left to go. And uh, we'll finish up the episode getting that bracelet. And there we go, that is 90 crafting. So I will go ahead and get myself 
uh, and Onyx. I think I've pretty much got um, enough Chaos Runes to do that. I'll need to buy a few more. I think um, just for the sake of speed, I will sell those that I've got now. And maybe in the next episode, do some barrows or something to get my um, get my supplies back a little bit. And then, yeah, get the plus five boost and um, let's make the bracelet. Got very lucky and it only took three stews to get that plus five boost. So let's enchant this bad boy. And that is the Tormented Bracelet. So just have a quick comparison against the Barrow's Gloves. So plus six, now it's plus 10 with 5% magic damage, which is really nice. And the plus two prayer as well. Well, that is gonna be it for today's episode. Hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Next episode, I'm hoping will be pretty good as well. I'm closing in on 99 strength which is uh, going to be the second 99 on the account, so that should be pretty good. Um, I'll probably just continue with Slayer. Um, the Nexus update is coming soon, so could be a few construction levels in there as well. Um, and probably just uh, a bit of skilling on the side. Um, but thank you for watching and hope to see you guys in the next episode. Take care.